What is a bystander intervention programme for the prevention of violence and abuse in student populations? My name is Dr Helen Mott and I am the co-creator of the Intervention Initiative, which is a programme developed at the University of the West of England and commissioned by Public Health England to address levels of sexual assault, sexual violence and harassment in our universities. The Intervention Initiative is very strongly grounded in social psychological theory. Uh, it takes as its premise the idea that we are all bystanders all the time in life and we can harness the power that we have as bystanders in order to make interventions that help to improve life for others. And that might be an intervention uh, when we witness something that is happening that is problematic or it might be an intervention at a low level if somebody is behaving in a way that we think could escalate into problematic behaviour or it could be learning how to be a really supportive listening ear when somebody is telling us about a traumatic experience that they've had. Bystander intervention theory is classic social psychological theory. Latine and Dali, who studied this extensively many years ago, taught us that there are a number of stages that we need to progress through in order to become effective bystanders. We have to notice that there is a problem. We have to feel that we want to do something about the problem. We have to feel that we have the skills and the confidence to act and then we need to be able to act appropriately. And in understanding that there is a problem in the first place, that implies a level of learning that we need to move up on. For example, if we're thinking about rape culture in universities, sexual assault in universities, identifying that there is a problem in the first place is the first step towards a journey of changing problematic attitudes that are held more widely in society and that are also reflected in the student population. So a bystander intervention programme deals with all of these stages that we need to go through to become an effective bystander and at the same time it encourages the people who are participating on the programme to re-evaluate the way that they think about the world in a way that does help to change attitudes. Get more from the Open University. Check out the links on screen now.